<laughs> this is Chuck Page, and he's a council member. And uh, do you remember anything, any of the first Saratoga festival that you had to worry about? <laughs> That I had to worry about. Well, I never worry about it because we've got such great volunteers in town that it always goes well. Yeah. So that's 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 number one. That's good. Um, what what we do worry about, and I mostly is what the weather's going to be like. But we ordered in a gorgeous day today, and sure and a God God bless us. So we're uh, it's an amazing day and a great group of people, and everybody I've talked to has got a big old smile on their face. So. What a great turnout, beautiful day, lots and lots of people, just fabulous. Could you, could you just give us a real short uh, paragraph, so to speak, of who, who, because some of our younger listeners mightn't remember how important you were to the community. Well, for those of you who have to Google me. Yes. It's uh, Joan Fontaine was my younger daughter, Olivia de Havilland was my older daughter. And they were famous movie stars in the 20s. Exactly, and 30s, I think, too. Uh -huh. um, I was frustrated movie star. I wanted to be. But just think, you came back to life, and here you are. <laughs> I, I pushed them so they could support me in my old age. Well, I'm glad that they're supporting you, because you look great. <laughs> the drugstore was... Um, Established about 1904 up on Lumber Street, and then it moved down to uh, Big Basin Way, uh, Dr. Hogg building. Dr. Hogg actually owned the pharmacy and had Mr. Buckley, who was the picture, the man in the, the postcard of the old drugstore. His name was Mr. Buckley. He was the first pharmacist uh, in the drugstore. And um, I took it over, of course, many years later in 1976. Today I play the role of Mrs. Charles Blaney, and this is my cousin, Miss Jenny Farwell. And Miss Farwell, I'm sure that you have some words to add to that wonderful description of the city of Saratoga. Well, Saratoga, I, I served as a vice president of the uh, Saratoga Chamber of Commerce. It wasn't called that back then, but I do believe very much in Saratoga as a beautiful little village. And I really think that we need to regrow it. It's a wonderful place to grow up. The Blossom Festival, my, my brother Frank started the Blossom Festival and I helped with that. So did Mrs. Blaney. And of course we're here because they're beautiful little children who appreciate the beauty of nature and will celebrate Blossom Festival with us and our heritage. Franklin Farwell and my sister Jenny Farwell. And you are part of the history of Saratoga. Oh, well, what I did was I established the Blossom Festival. Have you ever ridden in a car like that? Would you like to do it? Yeah, I think I would. Our youngest member is 10 years old. He's running around here, and our oldest member is 95 over there. We belong to the Early Days Gas Engine and Tractor Association. We're Branch 3 in the Bay Area here. And the Blossom Festival, is a, they've invited us here for the last, I've been involved with this for five years, so probably as many years as this has been going on. So we bring our old gas engines out and implements to display, and we've had quite a crowd here today. This has been a lot of fun.